Yo, what's up guys? How you doing today? How you feeling? Hope you guys are good, fresh, blessed, amazing. So yeah, um, uh, I'm just rushing to K24 for my meeting. Uh, then after that, I'm supposed to dash to Sarit Center to meet an amazing, amazing guy, an amazing young CEO, an amazing entrepreneur. Um, Hey guy, this guy, this guy is doing a lot of stuff. Yeah, so I hope you guys are gonna get to meet him and just to understand what more this guy does. So, but yeah, let me just dash there for my K24 interview. Then after that, sorry, it's center. Yo, what's up? So yeah, I'm actually just done with my K24 interview. So yeah, I'm rushing now to Westland Sari Center for my next meeting. Yo, so finally here, and yeah, my meeting is running um, uh, 15 minutes late. He just texted me, said he's gonna run 15 minutes late. So let's see if I can walk around with my Osmo vlogging inside a mall. I've never tried that in Kenya. I don't know if they're gonna kick me out or something like that. Let me let me let me try and see. Yeah, let me see if I can actually vlog inside a mall. It's gonna be interesting. Yeah, let's see that. One of other guys, girl. Me, 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 I'm a vlogger. A vlogger from where? No, to take a drone. What are you on a chicken? What are you on? It's my camera. What are you taking? I'm an on. I'm a social media personality. I'm going to do it. Where are you going? Come on. Put off fast, bro. Sorry? Put off fast, bro. Why? You're asking police officer why? Yeah, I'm asking why. You can teach my rights to know why. This is a private property. This is a private property. This is it. We have procedures. Wait, Bora. This is a two-no buy. The problem is, you know, you're taking a video where it's illegal. Illegal. It's illegal. But I have not seen that. why it says I can't take selfies, videos of myself. No, no, no. Now there's a security threat. Twenty. 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 It is good to know. Yeah, it's very but good. But why you taking? You know these places. You know my security are at. Why are you taking video with right? like malls like this one? Why? It's good to know. It's good to know. Because I've been coming to this place for a lot of times. Uh. Uh -huh. So you should come here. I come here like every day. It's so not my first time to come here. You take videos every day. Sorry. You take videos. I take every selfies. Day. I take Instagram uh, stories. I take everything. But it's it's good. Let's go. You have your poster? No photocopy or video. Every entrance. This is the entrance. This is the entrance. Every entrance. This is the entrance. Every 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 entrance. But first of all, I want to thank you guys, KOT, 
uh, Kenyans on Twitter, Kenyans on Instagram, and on Facebook for coming out in numbers and just making sure the hashtag free XDandela is trending top. And it's because of you guys that I'm actually free. Thank you very much for get for for just looking out for a brother and just standing by me and standing for me. And I just like to thank you for standing for. Uh, the Kenyan social media users and the, the bloggers, the YouTubers and just the digital community. Community, I want to salute you today and I want to thank you. At least I have my phone back, I have my camera back. Um, at least I also have the footage back, um, The what, what, what you've actually seen. Uh, that's what <laughs> went down and I'm shocked. You know, I got into Sarit Center. I didn't see any do not film signs, do not take any photos sign. And it's it, it's it's not common sense that I'm not supposed to film. Yo yo, this is this is Kenya. This is the 21st century, and I believe Kenya is a developing country. Kenya is a country that actually appreciates the digital space and social media. So I think there's freedom. There should be freedom to vlog and use social media freely, to use uh, Twitter, Instagram, Insta Stories, Snapchat, wherever you want. Especially in malls, yo, you know, <laughs> it, it bits logic. Why why should I? be actually arrested because of vlogging because of uh, of documenting my life my daily life it's it does it it beats purpose yo you know the thing is um, a lot of people out there follow f follow me and follow other social media users on on, on the uh, on the on the interwebs you know whatever we post we are proud of, uh, uh, of being Kenyan. I'm proud. I'm a proud Kenyan. And that is why I'll proudly show what we have in Kenya. A lot of guys follow me from the US. A lot of Kenyans from the US and in, in Europe and uh, Asia. And, you know, this these people want to see how home is. They want to see how developed the malls are, how the roads are. You know, this is what I show them on my daily vlogs. You know, it's so sad that I got into Sarin Center and I was actually arrested because of vlogging. And I'm like, yo... We have vloggers in the US, vloggers in, in, in Asia, in, in Dubai, across the world, vlogging in malls, showing guys how the malls look like, how business is thriving, how business is booming. And that's why we want to go there, because we are seeing through their eyes, through their daily lives, how, how, how these places are. And I just wanted to show guys how uh, Sarit Center has grown, how Kenya is growing, how proud I am how proud i feel about my country and then i get arrested are you for real i get arrested because of being a proud kenyan because of being a proud youtuber a proud vlogger are you for real you know it it's uh, it's depressing i must say it is depressing and I, I just pray you know i pray i pray that yo let us appreciate what we have let YouTubers be YouTubers. Let social media users be social media users. Let us promote our country. We love our country. I can die for this country. And I want other people out there, Kenyans who are not in Kenya, to appreciate and say, wow, my country is growing. My Kenya is growing. Whatever we left home is actually growing. I'm proud to be Kenyan. And today I felt really bad arresting me because of vlogging, of being proud of how Kenya is. Are you for real? You know, it's so, so sad. But, you know, I do thank Kenyans on Twitter. I do love you very much. And I'm really humble. The fact that you guys, I, I made a tweet. And the next thing I come out and see that I'm trending top. A lot of phone calls were, ma uh, were, were made. Yo. And I got released. Guys are asking, who are you? What are you doing? What do you do? Why are we being called? Like, yo, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. And I want to salute you today and tell you, yo, you know, Without you guys, I am nothing, and I accept it. I do accept that, and I know without you guys, I am nothing. And forever, it's going to humble me. It humbles me each and every day. And I salute and I appreciate you. The word is, yo, if you're a YouTuber, you're a social media user, do it, yo. Let's fight for our rights. You know, if we don't stop, stand up against this, the next thing you're going to hear is that it's going to be illegal to take selfies in town. Yo, this is a digital country. This is a digital world right now. You cannot suppress us. This, this is a revolution. It's going to stick. And you know what? Social media should be free, free for everyone. YouTube should be free. We should be vlogging and showing, oh my goodness. Yeah, let me not vent much. Yeah, I've had a long day. Yeah, just, oh my goodness. Ugh. Yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs>